What is up, y'all? It's Connor Deason out here checking, showing y'all my new project that I've been working out on. So, I've been out here digging a hole in this flower garden, supposed to be. And so, yeah, I got that dug, put this in there. It's supposed to be a fish pond. I got a solar air pump for it. So it lasts forever almost, kind of thing. And so, yeah, we gotta go buy fish today. So, that should go well, but I'm, I'm gonna go check my coon trap real quick because I left it out for the night, but we did have a big rainstorm. So, I don't know. All right, see you when we get there. All right, so I made it to the coon trap and I haven't seen it yet. But hopefully we got something in it. And it doesn't look like it. Nope, nothing's in it. Doors open. So, looks like we didn't do any good on the cane trap. Hopefully we do some good on finding fish, some rocks and stuff for the fish aquarium. I think we'll do better on that than we do on the coon trap. So, yeah. Let's go see what's up. I'll see you when we're at the fish shop. Alright, we are at the pet shop looking for fish. So, there's a, there's a little bit of a variety here. But, what I'm really looking for is goldfish, suckerfish, and maybe a playco for the little fish pond. And maybe even some... Oscars or something. So, let's see. Here's the Oscars. And, so, I might get an Oscar or something. Here's the goldfish. And, other things. But if we hit 1,000 subs on, on, on my channel, then I'll come back, buy a fish tank, and make a saltwater fish tank. And I'm going to put exotic fish in there. So, for example, like, they're probably not exotic, I don't think, but a clownfish. Or something like that one guy but yeah I'll do that I promise so I'll see you in a bit when we grab my fish picked out all right so we have got the fish we got a couple of goldfish like four or five maybe then we got three plants for the fish tank then we got a little Playco. And then we got this little guy. He's a cool little catfish. He, I forgot what his name, but he's cool looking. And I'll show you whenever we get back to the house. Whenever it's all finished. Or the progress we've made. Bye. See y'all later. So we are back at the house. I got two of these bags of gravel for the fish pond. Pink kind of thing yeah whatever but um two of those bags just to let y'all know we spent about a hundred dollars 108 to be exact so better be a good one then i got three of these plants they're not they're not the same but i got three of them for the pond later on whenever i get more money so i can spend on stuff for this fish pond more fish and stuff I'm going to get cooler stuff, but then I just got this for now. It was the cheapest thing there. Yeah, it was like, I don't know, like 14 bucks. So, I got the fish, in, I got the fish inside so they stay cool. I got to go and acclimate them whenever I get this all finished. Let's see if I can open this still. I think I'm going to have to use a shovel or something. Or the broke piece of a hoe.
Yeah, that works. Yeah. And then pour this in. For now, we got one Playco, one, it looks a little bit rare of a catfish, but um, yeah, got that, and then four goldfish for now, so. Before I put all the plants and stuff in, I am going to empty out some of this water because it's kind of dirty, but so, we'll do that. Also inside, is if the plants die or something, then I have a solar air pump that I can put out here. What a solar air pump does is basically whenever the sun's out, it charges it. And then whenever it charges, then it just pumps water, air, I'm sorry. Like I said earlier, I'm gonna get a saltwater aquarium at 100 subs and I'm gonna do top comment of the species of fish I'm gonna put in that aquarium. So we're gonna do that. 10,000 subs. I'm gonna get a red tail catfish and make a pond for that. So it should be good. I'm just pouring out this water in this garden, in the inside of the garden box. The boxes are on the outside, so it's not gonna ruin the garden boxes, but so it packs in the dirt of this. some of the water in this so whenever it rains it doesn't overflow and the fish jumps out fish jump out i was gonna get a white crawfish but it was like 30 bucks and i wasn't spending that money yet i'll get it soon and i'll show you the plants Individually. So I got this. I forgot. I, I honestly don't know what any of these plants are called, but the guy at the pet shop says he has these and they can grow a little bit. I'll, I'll do some research and um, I'll, yeah, I'll tell you on the comments or something. But he said these work really good, they can get bigger. But whenever they do, you have to take them out of the pot. So we'll just place that in there. After I spread out these rocks just a little.
animal plant in there. Then, you know actually what I'm gonna do? Y'all comment down below what these plants are. And then, yeah, I'll comment something like that. But I got this one. I just, I can get. I think the name is Bacopa Moneri, something like that. I don't know. Place this over here. So they do have the, the two I'm pulling out right now. Do have like little metal pipe around it, so they sink, not float like most plants do, but then I got this one. It doesn't have the name tag on it, so I don't know. All right, we got this planted. Now I got this thing. Look, we don't need this right here. I'll throw it away later, don't worry. I don't litter. I'm just gonna place it right in the middle and between all the plants. And then later on, whenever this actually gets kind of started, I'll get a big bush or something, put over the side of it so they have shelter, more shelter. And then I used to have a aquarium that had like Tetris and stuff. Now I don't, because they all died. Because I didn't have the, the right type of stuff. I'm gonna put those in there, wash them off. Get all the leaves out of here. I don't need those. But first I got this. So guys, they're fake, but they'll do. I got this little hydrilla looking hydr hydrilla looking plant. Then we got this guy. Um, I don't know what it's called either. It kind of looks like one of the ones we just put in there earlier. I'm gonna take this. Wash off my knees because you're gross. Alright, good on that. So, this is what it, you can't really see it, but that's what it looks like for now. But now I gotta go get fish. I'll see y'all back out here whenever they're acclimating. Then I'll show you, then I'll cut you there. And I'm going to show you whenever they're not acclimated, releasing them into the pond. See y'all when that happens. All right, they are acclimating right now. The goldfish right there. Placo's right there. And now weird little catfish, I forgot what it was. I'll look it up. Or y'all can comment down below, whatever. What kind of type of catfish it is. Catfish. And I'll see y'all whenever we're releasing them into the little pond. Peace. All right, so we are back out and it's been about 30, 40 minutes. So they should be all acclimated and everything. And I'm gonna show you one by one individually.
a little bit lazy. Bottom feeder. Alright, gonna do the little Playco. trash and yeah I'll show you the final result Can't see the fish too, too much. But hope y'all like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down all the things I told y'all to comment if y'all want to. Not, I'm not telling y'all to definitely do it or forcing you to. But don't forget to like and subscribe. Hope you like this video and comment down below if you want more of these videos or just shorts. I don't care. See y'all later.